Hey guys, Super Godzilla Final Wars here, and today we're back with another Kaiju OC profile, or Kaiju OC talk, or whatever you want to call it. So, today we're going to be talking about the second son of Man Godzilla, Mayfield Snow Godzilla. And his name is, well, as you guys can tell from the title, it is Man Godzilla Jr. I'm wondering why, why is that exactly? Well, he looks a lot more like his father and his grandfather combined. So, but he shares a lot more, in, like in appearance, he looks a lot more like his father rather than his grandfather. So that's why Man Godzilla called him Man Godzilla Jr. And of course, just like his older brother, Man Godzilla Jr. acts like, well, his father, basically. He acts a lot more like his father, actually. actually. He does have his mom's kind side, however. So, he's not all aggressive. He only is aggressive when he needs to be aggressive. I know. You know what you guys are gonna say? Well, why wasn't May Plasma Goji named May Godzilla Jr.? Well, you sure? Well, May Godzilla wanted to name him that, so yeah. So don't don't talk that out with me. Talk that out with him. I was the only one. I was the one who created the guy. So yeah. Anyways, moving on. And he is one of the young one. He's one of the younger siblings. And you're wondering what his age is. He's basically 15 years old for for now, basically. Eventually, he will become 16, basically. But for now, he's still 15. And surprisingly, he does have a mate. And a child already. And that was kind of fast because his parents did not expect that. But no, he's not married yet. But yeah, like I said before, he does have a mate and a child. So he was <laughs> just say he's the first one out of his out of his siblings to get a child. Not the first one to get a mate. His older brother and sister clearly beat him to that. I know what you guys are gonna say, but what about May Shadow Ghost? She basically adopted a child. Yes, but um the child that she adopted was not biologically related to her. So, Man Godzilla Jr. clearly takes the Golden Cup for this round. <laughs> Basically, he wins. <laughs> it's because he actually has a child a child that is related to him. And if you're wondering what is his wife and, well, his girlfriend and his child's name, his maid's name goes by the name of Mad. Hmm. Give me a moment. Okay, so his mate's name goes by the name of Mega Rulers of Earth Goji, or Godzilla Rulers of Earth, or whatever you want to call him. And I'll tell, and I'll reveal the real identity for her in the link in, in description below. And his daughter goes by the name of Mega Rezan, basically. If you're wondering how tall is he, he's just around 318.5 meters. He's kind of the smallest, smallest out of his two older siblings, but then again, he is taller than his other siblings. Now, like his father, he's extremely aggressive. So if he will attack and kill anyone or anything that threatens to hurt or kill his friends and family members. And he will do anything in his power to protect his friends and family members. So, yeah. Um, for his top breath color is 
Well, kind of actually the same as his father's, except instead of the... Well, Mad God's Souls of Tonic Breath is actually a bit more lighter blue with a dark red ray around it. Mad God's Souls Jr., on the other hand, his of Tonic Breath is similar, but a bit more different. What I'm trying to say is the blue Tonic Breath is a bit more darker, and the red ray around it is a bit more brighter. A bit more light ray. A bit more of light red, basically. So, yeah. For its design, well, it's basically a mixture of Godzilla 2000 and Godzilla 2004. And obviously the spines, well, are obviously the same as his dad, so... And the charge-up ability, same thing as well. For his arch-rival, it's, well... Surprisingly, it's Maya's Space Godzilla who is his arch-rival. Mainly because, surprisingly, he battles Maya's Space Godzilla more than his father does. That and Maya's Space Godzilla did threaten to kill his main and child. And, well, Maya Godzilla Jr. would have had it if Maya's Space Godzilla didn't do a little surprise attack. And his older siblings came in to help him out. So, yeah. Anyways, moving on. He is a lot more faster than his other siblings. He is actually known to be one of the most fastest man Godzilla's because he actually runs very really fast. So, to say, when it comes to hunting trips, he does the one, he's basically the one who chases the prey to his siblings and, of course, his parents. And, of course... Sorry about that, I just had to get a drink. Anyways, um... <laughs> so, moving on. Mega Godzilla is not... Mega Godzilla Jr. is not that good at fighting at long range. Like, when it comes to long range combat, he's not really that good. Close combat is a different story. Close to close combat, he's basically like his father, basically. But long range combat... He's not that good. He does get a little hesitant and sometimes that ends up being his downfall. He does almost get killed a few times, but he still manages to at least come out with his life intact. And, and sometimes he can be a bit more of a hothead than his father. Because sometimes when Man Godzilla Jr. gets angry, he just loses it. Unlike his father, he finds a very he finds it hard to control his anger. So. There's something that he needs to learn from his dad, of course. And that's pretty much it. There's not a whole lot to talk about him. Just like his older sister. Yeah, not really a whole lot to talk about, but yeah. Anyways, hope you guys liked this video. Like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to have a make or cheer with excellence, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.